Excellent. Excellent. I'll put it in a letter and it'll be there tomorrow. It will? Yes, it will. It will? No, no it won't. Yes, it will. It will? Yes, it will. It will? Federal Express introduces something nobody's going to believe. The overnight letter. It costs only $9.50 when you drop it off. And unlike most letters, it actually gets there tomorrow. It did. It did. It did. Call us. We'll send you everything you need to get started. Bad tomatoes, not in Heinz. General, you know I would never question your orders or sagacity, and that my sword is yours and yours alone, but may I speak freely? Continue. We could have captured Dracula for the pursuit. As long as Vlad is alive and seems to be a threat to Romanus, they will need the Roe army to fight him. They will live in fear, and we shall be their salvation. Romanus will have no choice but to adhere to our control. Pawns must be sacrificed in order to capture a king. We could have captured him a century ago. Why did we not? Dracula is an insect that means nothing. I pride myself on my thoroughness. I am esteemed for my thoroughness. I am a philosopher by reputation, riding on the banner of sober and unmitigated thoroughness. <laughs> oh, you impress me to the roots of my hair. <laughs> but that is only one side of my character, of course. Ooh, a many-faceted jewel. Slow down. Take a deep breath. You can handle this. Who are you? Bernie Bite, at your service. But you can't be real. I'm as real as anything else inside a computer. How may I help? Hey, kid. How you doing? I'm Buster Bite. I can help you get this problem with Ajax off your line fast. I know all the shortcuts here. Don't listen to him. That's my brother Buster, the lowlife of the family. He always tries to take the easy way out. You don't want to treat your clients like that. Eh, he's such a goody two-shoes. Listen, you gotta cut a few corners in today's world if you want to move fast. <laughs> Did this madman scientifically preserve his own dead daughter? It's time to meet Daddy the Little Ghoul. Why did you get a breast implant? Why did you get a breast implant? Well, Is she aging? Are you trying to age her chronologically? Uh, chronologically, I want her to develop to the full potential of her, her womanhood. When you, and what doctor was willing to put breast implants in a dead corpse? Well, that was Dr. Refugio's <laughs> Where'd you go? Mexico? Well, it's near the border, Texas and Mexico. I don't really? want to reveal exactly where. It took quite a while to locate this gentleman, who did a wonderful job, I might add. Is this the dagger which I see before me? Let me clutch it. Art thou not fatal vision, sensible to feeling as to sight? Or art thou but a dagger of the mind? A false creation proceeding from the heat oppressive brain? As I was saying, I was down in the class 3 cafeteria yesterday and I ran into those power morons from the transformer room. No transformer, no juice. No juice, no show. What good is power without brains? Master control is the nerve center of this organization. Danny, will you get in here? Danny! Finally. What, what, your favorite. What the Sweet fuck is this? Hey, wait a minute. Toasted what is cheese. This? Toasted? What do you mean toasted? Oh, this I soggy, toast. flappy, floppy piece of bread? Toaster oven. Don't tell me that's broken too. 
At least she gave me some cheese in my toasted cheese sandwich. Oh, it might not be toasted, but at least there's cheese, huh? Is that what you're thinking? At least the old man has some cheese. Oh, what time is it? He has some cheese. Every fucking day you do something to annoy me. Jack Spy here. Listen, Chief, the book... Yes, the book's almost finished. Yeah, I just need a little more time and a little more research. And a, uh, a slight advance. Oh, say $5,000. My daughter did get involved with some very unsavory characters. The last months of life. She did go off the deep end and started convorting with, 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 with innumerable club kids and whatnot. Your son Marco was a part of that wild bunch. That's a slander. My son was never involved. He was her older brother, and he tried to steer her to a decent path. Your son Marco is a person of questionable character. Oh, you don't believe me? I'll tell you what. Go to the club CIA. CIA? Yes, it's the California Institute of Abnormal Arts. Henry is a son of a bitch, isn't he? Henry took this from my room when I was asleep. I think he thought that would be funny. You were never supposed to see this book. And I sincerely hope you don't think it means anything, because it doesn't. It's just a story. I was never going to grow up and be a dancer. It's just something little girls want. Oh, Christ, Alice, you think I don't know that? What did I just say? Why can't you shampoo your own hair? Please, don't argue with me. Just shampoo my hair. I used... Don't you remember? I used to shampoo your hair. When you were a little kid. And I made sure the soap didn't get in your eyes. You had beautiful, you had blonde hair. What the fuck do you want me to do? Huh? What the fuck do you want me to do? Shampoo my hair, please. Oh my fucking Christ. Well, I'm gonna go find someone who appreciates my help. Good grief. Speaking of bugs, I'd better get going. I'm gonna miss you. Me too. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Ha, 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 ha,